Hey everyone, it's Tian here. Um, so here's my laptop. It's the Toshiba A665 S6065. I did an I did an unboxing on it and a review on it. So if you haven't checked it out yet, go ahead and check that out right now. And I'm just gonna show you guys my Hackintosh. So I have Mac OS X installed on it as well as Windows 7 64 uh, bit. Uh, on a different partition so I'm dual booting it it's definitely a Windows computer you can see it's not a Mac I didn't pay two thousand dollars for it I paid seven ninety nine and the real price for it was nine ninety nine so I got a great deal the specs are the it's the Intel Core i7 720QM uh, 1.6 gigahertz turbo boost to 2.8 gigahertz uh, 4 gigs of RAM 500 gigabyte hard drive um, one gigabyte video graphics so it's, it's a pretty good laptop and I was able to hackintosh it so now I am running Snow Leopard on it and I used uh, the iBoot plus retail disk method and there are some things that I need to work out it's just some kinks uh, Wi-Fi isn't working and you'll see how I get through that I'm gonna turn it on you'll see how I get Wi-Fi on my laptop because I have to right now only Ethernet works so how I connect to the web is I have my iPhone 4 attached to it and I'm tethering I tether my iPhone which is connected to my home Wi-Fi and it tethers it gives the Wi-Fi connection to my laptop via the cable so I don't always have to be right next to my router so you can see uh, the it's loading I have iBoot inside I tried to install a bootloader uh, so I could run Mac without iBoot, but I don't know why it wouldn't work. But this is my setup just for now. Uh, I still have to, you know, work some things out. All right, so here's iBoot. Uh, I'm gonna go to Hackintosh. Equals <sighs> one. Bus ratio. So that's going to refresh the kernel. Uh, dash dash f dash f uh, dash v. So it boots in verbose mood. CPU equals one and bus ratio equals twelve. Uh, makes it so my mouse doesn't lag. Or else without it. it just lags a lot. So I'm gonna go ahead and hit enter. And there we go. So Mac OS X uh, Snow Leopard 10.6.6 has been loaded up all the way. You see I have the Mac App Store right there. And I have Twitter for Mac right there. I'm going to show you that I can browse the web since I'm tethering from my iPhone. Here is Apple's website. Again, you can see it's definitely Safari, not Firefox. So yeah, uh, I have to get sound working on this, and I think the iPhone method for now works okay. So once I have sound working, it'll be perfect, pretty much. Uh, so yeah, thanks for watching, guys.